Chattanooga State students can use the activity period on Wednesday, September 15th from 10 to 11 to learn about campus clubs in their area of interest, roam around campus, and take a look at what Chattanooga State has to offer you. Do you like music with a little dash of the south thrown in? Maybe a little something like this? Expect that and a whole lot more on the Southern Style every Tuesday at 6 p.m. Eastern. Only on The Wall. Expect clear skies to continue through the evening hours. Still quite warm out there overnight tonight. Comfortable again. Lows into the mid-50s. For Tuesday as well as the midweek, not much change. Lots of sunshine looking dry for the next few days. Highs into the upper 80s to near 90. This forecast is brought to you by Lake Winnebasoka. Now open this Saturday and Sunday featuring the new Sea Warrior, the Ozone, along with over 35 rides and attractions for the whole family. That's Lake Winnie open this weekend. And I'm 1412 Chief Meteorologist Patrick Hoare for Chattanooga State's The Wall. W-A-W-L, Chenega State's The Wall, currently 89 degrees with partly cloudy skies here in Chattavegas. 
You're listening to Metal Empire. We started things off black and blue. That's right, Black Sabbath, and followed it with Blue Oyster Cult. That was their uh, tour in the early 80s, the black and blue tour. So uh, maybe that'll uh, spark some memories for a few of you that are close to my age. Anyway, I'm not going to dawdle. I'm going to play some Paradise Lost. Here's Small Town Boy on Chenega State's The Wall.
If you're interested in the Health Information Management Program at Chattanooga State, you will need to know about the information sessions where you will learn about the application process, the selection process, the curriculum, career opportunities, admission requirements, and more. Attendance is not required, but it is strongly encouraged. The next Health Information Management Information Session will be on Friday, September 17th at 10 a.m. in Room 2106 of the HSC Building. You have questions? Ask Joan at 423-697-4450 or visit chattanoogastate.edu. Oh, and be sure to tell her you heard it through the wall. I'm the only one in school that can tie his own shoes. Most kids make fun of me because I still believe in the tooth fairy. A third of the kids in my eighth grade class drink alcohol regularly. Over 99% of my class has been offered illegal drugs. Half of my college classmates binge drink, abuse drugs, or do both. But the frequent dinners I had with my family have helped make sure I'm not one of them. Celebrate Family Day on September 27th. Learn more from the National Center on Addiction and Substance Abuse at Columbia University at casafamilyday.org. Dinner makes a difference. W-A-W-L, Chattanooga State's The Wall. After that public service announcement, I got nothing. Nothing. But I got children of Bodom. Here's a cover of Shot in the Dark on Chattanooga State's The Wall.
I'm Pierce. This is our number two of Metal Empire. And what we're going to do right now is uh, play a band that is, uh, well, to say they were influential is uh, an understatement. The uh, album Welcome to Hell came out in 1981. They've been uh, tagged with a new wave of British heavy metal, thrash metal, yada, yada, yada. Um, What they're really known for is uh, pioneering the term black metal, although their their music sounds much, much different than that of uh, Cradle of Filth or um, Emperor. Uh, But anyway... Here's Kronos, Montas, and Abaddon doing Witching Hour on Chattanooga State's The Wall. There we go.
W-A-W-L, Vince Neal on Metal Empire, breaking in the gun from uh, his mid-90s solo effort, which uh, the name escapes me. Up next, more recent music from Exodus, the, uh, the kings of Bay Area Thrash, off of Exhibit B, here's the hammer and life on Chattanooga State's The Wall.
Tennessee Highway Patrol will conduct driver license roadside safety checkpoints in Hamilton County during the week of September 12th to September 18th. Recognizing the danger presented to the public by unqualified drivers, troopers will concentrate their efforts on vehicles being operated by drivers who would violate the driver license laws of Tennessee. The Tennessee Highway Patrol has found that driver license roadside safety checkpoints are an effective means of enforcing driver license laws of Tennessee while ensuring the protection of all motorists. All scheduled checkpoints are contingent upon manpower availability and weather conditions. This message is brought to you courtesy of Tennessee Highway Patrol and Chattanooga State's WAWL The Wall. What could be more devastating than something that affects your face? Rosacea mars the appearance of more than 16 million Americans, usually after age 30. Without treatment, it could inflict serious physical damage, such as excess tissue and reduced vision. So don't ignore the signs of rosacea. Facial redness, bumps and pimples, visible blood vessels, or irritated eyes. With any one of these signs, see a dermatologist. Or visit the National Rosacea Society website, rosacea.org. W-A-W-L, Chenega State's The Wall. It's that time again for the oddball duo track that we do on, on Metal Empire. And this time it's a uh, live recording with a Black Sabbath Here's uh, NIB featuring Ronnie James Dio on vocals.
W-A-W-L, Chattanooga State's The Wall. That's Creator with Suicide Terrorist from their Enemy of God release. Up next, the band from Texas, uh, comprised of three members. And uh, no, they don't have, well, maybe they have beards, but they're not ZZ Top. This is Absu and a song called Amy on Chattanooga State's The Wall.
Enzo Garcia. Scribble Monster and his pals. Trout, Trout Fishing in America. America. Eric Herman and the Invisible Band. This is Yossi. Uncle Moondog. And this is Dave from the Saturday Morning Cereal Bowl. Home to these artists and many, many more parents just for your kids to listen to. Because there is quality music out there for them. The Saturday Morning Cereal Bowl is a show jam-packed with rock, country, folk, and a lot of other kinds of music. Tune in to the Saturday Morning Cereal Bowl every Saturday at 8 a.m. Expect clear skies to continue through the evening hours. So quite warm out there overnight tonight. Comfortable again. Lows into the mid-50s. For Tuesday as well as the midweek, not much change. Lots of sunshine looking dry for the next few days. Highs into the upper 80s to near 90. This forecast is brought to you by Lake Winnebasoka. Now open this Saturday and Sunday featuring the new Sea Warrior, the Ozone, along with over 35 rides and attractions for the whole family. That's Lake Winnie open this weekend. And I'm 1412 Chief Meteorologist Patrick Hoare for Chattanooga State's The Wall. W-A-W-L, Chenega State's The Wall, currently 89 degrees with scattered clouds, basically uh, the same as it was when I uh, made my uh, dramatic entrance into the uh, studios here at Chenega State, UCLA, as they used to say, uh, University of Chenega left on Amnicola, depending on which direction you're, uh, you're headed. It's that time once again where my program is drawing to a close. I'd like to invite everyone to join me again next Monday at 5 Eastern for two more hours of Metal Empire. And we will try to squeeze some new music on here as well. There is a new Spiritual Beggars release. We're going we're gonna to preview that and um, see if there's a tune or two off of that. And uh, a couple of others that uh, escape me at the moment. But I'm going to leave you, as is customary, with uh, 10 hours of, <laughs> I wish, 10 minutes of music. And uh, begin with, from 1987, the uh, album's called So Far, So Good, So What? The prime lineup of Megadeth, in my opinion. Here's In My Darkest Hour on Chenega State's The Wall.
From the main campus of Chattanooga State Technical Community College at 4501 Amnicola Highway, WAWL Red Bank Chattanooga is your voice of variety in the Tennessee Valley. This hour of music is brought to you by Enigma Magazine, Chattanooga's premier source for arts and entertainment. Available in print and online at enigmaonline.com.